Hello Unlimited friends, it's Zara back again to answer questions about the application of the law of attraction to our lives. So the question comes from Jay. It was emailed to me and Jay says, my most pressing need is for money. Passive cash flow, please help. That's the extent of the question. Now, I'm going to give a very generalized answer because it's a very generalized question. Here's what I'm going to say to Jay. The first thing is, sweetheart, if you say that you have a pressing need, where does that put you on the emotional scale? Are you high on the emotional scale or low on the emotional scale? My guess is that you are low on the emotional scale when you say that you have a pressing need. So what do you need to do? If you're low on the emotional scale, there's only one thing to do, and that is to go up the emotional scale. And what are the things that you have to do in order to go up the emotional scale? Well, the first one is to make peace with where you are and stop, um, stop beating up on reality. Stop saying things like, why am I here? Why is this happening to me? What can I do about it? Stop saying all of that and find something to appreciate. What can you appreciate? Whether it's the sky or a tree or a bird, doesn't matter. The point is to generate the vibration of appreciation. And if you can't find anything in your own life to appreciate, then look outside of your life. Regardless, there is only one cure and that is to find a way to appreciate. And the second thing that you can do is to meditate. A combination of meditation and appreciation is the best, fastest working formula. If you only meditate or if you only appreciate, it does not work. Lastly, the thing that you have to do is to disregard all your negative beliefs. Start telling yourself that whatever your past beliefs were, you're willing to let them go. And when an opportunity shows up, do something about it. Don't beat it up and disregard it by saying things like, oh, I can't do that. Don't do that. So that's the second part of my answer to you. When you say you want to create passive income, all you have to do is close your eyes and ask the universe, what should I do to create passive income? An answer will come. That answer is going to be specific to you. And now, once the answer comes, now work is involved because the universe is not going to do the work for you. There is physical, tactile work involved and you have to do that work. You cannot say, oh, I have this idea that the universe gave me, but I'm too old for it or there's too much cam uh, competition for it or I don't have the skills for it, embrace it because the universe has brought it to you. Take it and then run with it. Do whatever you have to do in order to make it a success instead of finding excuses to kill it. Let me give you an example for myself. Okay. Now, um, it's probably many years now, uh, when I was sort of in the same situation as yourself. I wanted to create a passive income for myself and I didn't know how. I had never created a YouTube video before. I had never written a book before, but I, I was first guided, first of all, I was guided to do a blog. I didn't know anything about blogging. I didn't know anything about websites. But I found out when I was guided to do a YouTube, I didn't know how to do YouTube. I didn't know how to record a video. I didn't know how to do video editing. But because I was given the idea, I then got to work and I found out how to do these things. <coughs> I didn't let anything get in my way. I was like, I'm guided to do this, so I'm just going to do it. Even my children laughed at me. 
because I went first to my daughter because she was the older one. I went for and she's very techy. I went first to my daughter and I said to her, can you show me? Do you know how to do a YouTube video? Can you show me? Because I think I want to do law of attraction videos. She laughed at me and she did not show me. And I said, that's fine. I don't have to depend on you. The universe has, has guided me that this is what I need to do. So I'll figure it out. And I did. Once the universe shows you the way, then it's up to you. It's back to you. Then you have to be open to learning whatever you need to learn, doing whatever you need. So then from there, after YouTube, I was guided to write a book. I didn't start writing a book. I started writing, writing a regular blog post and the blog post became a book. And then I said, well, now I have a book. So I guess I should find out how to publish it. And I did. I found out how to publish it. Now people come and ask me how to do these things. And I'm like, you can figure it out. I did. So, Jay, whatever it is that you are called to do, you see, you will be called. The universe will call you to that which is within your level of capability because the universe will always find the path of least resistance for you. Whatever that is, it's your path of least resistance. So what was I guided to do? There was a time when I had three jobs. And there was a time, they, for the past 12 years, I think, I have done my business and held a full-time high responsibility, high level corporate job, both at the same time. Anyone else would have said, well, that's just not possible. But I said to myself, I have the capacity to do more work than two people combined. My capacity for work is massive. I can do it. And I did. You see, you can tell yourself that you can do it and you can equally tell yourself that you can't. Whichever one you pick is true. That really is how law of attraction works. So what are you guided to do? What is the universe telling you to do? I'm not going to tell you what the universe is telling you to do because that answer is going to come to you. Ask the question, receive the answer and then go do it. I opened my heart like this one day and I said, Universe, I will go wherever you tell me to go. I will talk to whoever I need to talk to. I will learn whatever I need to learn. I will do whatever I need to do. Just point the finger, point in me in the right direction and I will go and do it because action is involved. Hard work is, so I won't say it's hard work because when the universe guides you, you enjoy doing that work. It does not feel like hard work, but it is work. It is time consuming. It does require you to apply yourself. But that application does not feel like a struggle. It feels like you're getting closer to what you want. It feels like a joy because you know you're on your way. So the biggest mistake I made, one, well, I made lots of mistakes. One of the biggest mistakes I made was to believe the secret movie that there is no work involved. And that is absolutely not true. Law of Attraction does require you to do work. But Law of Attraction will show you what work will bring you the kind of results that you're looking for. Whatever those are. And that's why it's going to be different for everyone because it's going to be based on what you want to accomplish, what your belief systems are and what the universe knows that you are capable of. So Jay, I hope that this response is helpful to you, sweetheart. You got to do what you got to do. That's any story of anyone who has been through a dark time in their life. They will tell you that they did what they had to do. And that is the main thing. You do what you have to do. Because you have to go with your current belief systems. 
you can't go in opposition to your belief systems and the universe will never show you a path that is not attainable for you. The universe will always bring you that which it knows is your path. All right. So I did not do an introduction in the beginning, but I will do one just now. For those of you who are new to my channel, thank you for coming. For those who are returning, thank you for your support. I'm Zara Mahoon. I write the blog zmahoon.com. And uh, I am the author of 15 different books based on the law of attraction. On this channel, I answer questions from my subscribers, from you. So if you have a question about the law of attraction, send me an email through my website zmahoon.com. And um, if you want to learn law of attraction and really be successful with it, because I'll tell you that there's a lot of talk about law of attraction out there. A lot of teachers are putting the label of law of attraction on things that are actually really not law of attraction at all. And I won't say that they mean any harm, but maybe they just don't know any better. But I will tell you that if you... I did that. I followed those teachers and I wrecked my life. And then that wreckage helped me to actually find the answers for which I am absolutely grateful now. But what I'm going to say to you is if you really want to learn about law of attraction, you, you want to learn from me because my message resonates with you, then there are a couple of things that you can do. The easiest way to start working with me is to grab a copy of the unlimited workbook. Let me show you the workbook because I have it handy right here. So grab the unlimited law of attraction workbook on Amazon. It is available in Kindle as well as print and audio formats. And join the, the workbook Facebook group because in that Facebook group, I teach the exercises in the workbook every single day, Monday to Friday. And so that is where the biggest transformations take place. And that is the beginning of the journey. Um, and, and, and then in addition to that, I hold a weekly live Zoom call to answer questions for people who subscribe to my monthly coaching program. You can most definitely find out about that. If you're interested, send me a message and I can provide you with details. I have several courses on the Law of Attraction. Some of them are listed below in the description. You can, um, you can join one of my courses. And at, at the end of the day, I also provide one-on-one -on -one coaching. And I only take on two coaching clients in a month. So if you are interested in one-on-one -on -one coaching with me, then send me a message and do so only if you really are willing to invest in yourself. All right. Other than that, I'm here and I will answer any questions that you send me. Bye for now.